What up, though? I'm Fats. I'm Tree. Welcome back to another edition of Fats, Fats and Tree. And today, what we're going to talk about save money on your next cruise. We can really tell you ways how you can save money on your next cruise. And the first thing we're going to talk about is bringing your own snacks. And you know how we like our snacks. Your so chips. You your dip, candy. Your candy. All your snacks that you want to, you know you want, that bring you them on. Bring yeah. them on. We're not saying bring no juices or no waters. They're not prohibited. Yeah. Because once you get inside and you realize, that especially if you have children or you have your own uh, sweet tooth, the cherry on top store candy is very expensive. By the pound. It charged by the pound. Mm -hmm. You think you're getting a pound worth? It might look like three or four pieces. So make sure you want to bring all your goodies that you like, Pringles, candy, chocolate, whatever kind you like. A lot of y'all know you like those Gumbies, and they got Gumbies. Bring it on. They don't have adult Gumbies, though. So I'm going to tell you a fun fact about the cherry on the top. Last cruise, New Year's cruise, we was in the, the Carnival Valley out of New Orleans. Um, they gave Fats a coupon to go in cherry on the top. They gave him what? Five dollars off. Five dollars off. And he ended up going in there getting chocolate cover. Uh, toffees. Toffees. Okay. And I was like, you're gonna have to weigh it because you don't want to go over that five dollars. Yeah. When he came out, those toff chocolate cover toffees were big. Guess what? Looked like he only got about twenty five of them. I was like, goodness. And I was like, wow. And I think I got one on a couple extra dollars to it. Yes. So it came over $25 uh, and it ended up being, I think, 6 or $7. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that's one of the places you try to avoid is that cherry on that top because they weigh about a pound. Mm -hmm. The pound could be like, what, $4.99, $2.99, $3.99, whatever. The, I don't know what the pound weight is, mm -hmm. but you look like you won't get nothing out of there. Yep. Next, we're going to talk about, we know a lot of people like to get that drink package. Oh, if you don't want to get the drink package, you can bring a bottle of wine per person. Every person in the in the room that's over the uh, age of 18. So. Yes. And a lot of people bring their own wine. Um, we don't because I don't drink wine. We might, if we bring it, we then give it away to we'll somebody. gift it. But... Again, when you bring your own wine, be sure that you know that there is a cork charge. The way you get around that is get the screw off top. There's some wines that have the screw off top, mm -hmm. but you have to make sure that that wine is 750 milliliters. If it ain't, it ain't going in there. And don't put it in your carry-on, I mean your luggage, bring it in your carry-on and in your hand. Because if you put it in your luggage, they will confiscate it. Have it on you so that they can check it to make sure. And then they'll just tell you, you're okay. Mm -hmm. Next, we're going to talk about bringing your own sodas. Bring your own sodas. Ooh, that's a lot of lugging. Yes, because it depends on what ship cruise line you're cruising with. Mm -hmm. um, sodas are not free. So it depends on what cruise line you're with. You're with Virgin, sodas are free. Yes. If you're cruising with Carnival, sodas cost like two fifty a can. So be reminded of that. And a lot of the other companies, they like to charge you for a soda package. So be prepared to bring your own 12-pack. Everybody I think, in the I'm room. I'm sitting here thinking, I think Virgin is probably the only one who offer you free sodas. If I'm, if y'all know of any other cruise line that offers free sodas, put it in the comments for me. Mm -hmm. But I believe they're the only ones. Everybody else, I think you have to bring it. We have not did Celebrity. We are going to do it, but we can let you know about them. But I think they're the only ones. Yep. Next, we're going to talk about is saving money at the port. Yes, looking for deals. And that's hard to find out on the Ooh, Lord, and <laughs> this is something we're doing. If we're looking for deals, we go and compare store by store, and the best deal wins, and you pay for it. 
They might have souvenir t-shirts for what? Five for 25. Next door might have them three for 25. You gonna go back to the five for 25 because you can get more for your buck. That's right. Look at the deals on and, the port. And nine times out of 10, those are not the deals that we just said. We're just using that as um, an example. example. But again, we're just trying to give you an example so you can go to the port and try to compare prices. Mm -hmm. Don't get the first thing. That happened to Fess at uh, Jamaica on the port. Mm -hmm. He wanted to get some imported alcohol. He going to store to store and he ended up paying more when down the hall or down the walkway there had it way cheaper. So compare your prices and weigh your options. Mm -hmm. Next we're gonna talk about is taking your own pictures. Saving money. Saving money. It's up to you if you want to take the uh, port pictures, the pictures that the cruise line provide. But if you take your own pictures, you can save money. There's always somebody on the cruise ship that will take your camera and snap your picture for you. And then when you get home, you can just send that picture out and get it downloaded, just like the pictures that they got. Um, on but, Carnival, they have picture prices and picture packages, but guess what? They're expensive. They're expensive. So if you want to save money, take your own photos. You dressed up, you looking nice, you want to show everybody, you look, I look good. Mm -hmm. So take your own pictures, save your money. Next, you're going to talk about saving on souvenirs. Yes. Sometimes the Carnival um, Fun Shop has souvenir t-shirts. I don't know if they'll be cheaper than the port, but guess what? Go to the port, look at what they got. Then Carnival got theirs, look what they got, because theirs usually about two for $25 or something like that. And if you can find it cheaper, go ahead and purchase those souvenirs. You can buy shot glasses, key rings, uh, magnets, whatever you want. Your souvenir is what you need. Mm -hmm. Next up we're gonna talk about is going to the pop-up shops on the cruise ship. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times the pop-up shop it doesn't be inside the store. They line up on the outside of the store. They have things for $5, $10, and so forth up. So if you want to find a good deal and you might see something you like, don't say, I'm going to come back because it's probably be gone. It's going to be gone, especially if it's at a good price. So again, make sure you um, go to the pop-up shops. Mm -hmm. Next you're going to talk about is Stay away from those specialty diamonds. If you can't afford it. Yeah, if you can't, if you want to save money, stay away from those. There's a lot of them. And when you download your Carnival Hub app, it will tell you. Even some items on room service is no longer free. No longer free. And thinking of that, room service have a new feature. If you um, want to buy chicken wings or whatever, and you're sitting at the casino and you want to get a little something and you don't want to leave, take a picture of where your location and let them know where you are. They'll bring the food to you. Mm -hmm. So they got new features. Download the Carnival Hub app today. Next up, we're going to talk about is the free things that they do have on the ship. You have to really move around to find out where they're located. But nine times out of 10, they have free things at the service desk. Uh, they have free shots of liquor uh, when they do uh, liquor tastings. Uh, they do raffles. Um, there's not a lot of things that are free, but there are things that are free on the ship. And then once you get on there, if you go around and check it out, you'll find something. Also, the amenities like uh, the water park, the water slides at the top. You got golf, basketball. You even got the rope course. Um, All of that comes with your package. When yes, you your cruising package. So there are a lot of free things that you can take advantage of. Even bingo. Let's, you know, all that. Cause you don't have to, you can pay, you don't have to buy a bingo board. You have two options with bingo. You can buy a board and you can play in the audience for free and just look. Same thing with deal or no deal. You don't have to buy a board. You can play in the audience and you know, you can play all that. So again, look at the, enjoy all the free items. Next, we're gonna talk about something that is important to a lot of people. It's making sure you got your medicine right. 
because there's no turning back if you don't have it. So um, the medicine, when you have to go to one of the fun shops to get it, aspirins are very expensive. Yeah. Any acid pills, when you get heartburns from eating too much of that pizza, you're going to get heartburns most likely from the drinking. You're going to get heartburn. So you want to make sure that you bring these things with you. And acid, uh, Vaseline, uh, some type of bandage, which is a, like a little small first aid kit. All of these things will prevent you from having to buy this stuff from the fun shop. Yeah. That means when you bring this stuff with you, you're saving money. And that's what this video is about, saving money. So you want to make sure you have all of those things in your carry-on bag. Next, we're going to talk about is C bands. C bands. <laughs> just that you might not get sick, you might get sick, but on the safe side, just have you a couple of C bands. Yeah. You can go to Amazon, they sell them by the whole pack, mm -hmm. maybe 12 of them in a pack. Because uh, some people might not want a, uh, a C band, they might want the pill. But you can go to Amazon, you can get them, you can switch it every day, but it tell you the same band will work for three to four days if you buy the C-band bracelets, and that should do you <laughs> good. Not everybody gets sick. Some people will. You might have a friend. Yeah. So if you got a whole pack. You can help them out. You can help them out because they sometimes certain things that you really need be, can become very expensive once you get onto a ship. Yes. It's not your ordinary yes. $125 tree. Mm-hmm. So if you like this video, give, give us a, a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Let us know. We are glad that you made it this far through the video. So you are enjoying it and you getting benefit from mm -hmm. the video. Bonus tip of today is download, download the, the Carnival, Carnival Hub, Hub app. app. Download that Carnival oh, Hub get on over there, y'all. Download that Carnival Hub app. I don't care what ship you on. Download, download that app. the Hub app or the Cub app or whatever app it is that will give you the information that you need to navigate yourself around the ship and know where to be. Because if, if you don't download the Carnival Hub, I guess what happened? You don't even know what time is time to eat. <laughs> so we're gonna insert another video here to help you save more money or whatever the case may be. Thank you for watching. Peace, love, and Ooh, sad.